Hello Tigers, welcome to Tiger Vision News for Tuesday, October 24th. I'm Weston and this is my co-host Max. Thanks for joining us today. I heard something pretty cool coming out of, of the Spanish class the other day. Yeah, I did too. They were working on a pretty interesting assignment. Let's find out more. Hi, my name is Trinity and I'm here with... Charles Olivier. What are y'all doing in Miss Gonzalez's class today? So today we're in Miss Gonzalez's class talking about the tradition of El Dia de los Muertos and where those traditions come from and the different cultures that have come to make the celebration what it is today. And why are sugar skulls important to their culture? So sugar skulls are important to their culture because it has to do with a thing that happened about a couple hundred years ago in Mexico. They had a very famous artist, his name was Posada, and he created this figure called the Katrina. And the Katrina is a skeleton figure that is dressed in very fancy clothes and it symbolizes equality. And they started incorporating the skeleton into the celebration of El Dia de los Muertos and they started doing it by using these sugar skulls. Thank you so much. Thanks for that report. We'll be back right after this commercial. Wait, stop. Did you wash your hands? Wash your hands, wash your hands. Everybody come along and wash your hands. Wash your hands, wash your hands. Everybody Thanks for reminding us to wash our hands so we don't get germs. Welcome back to Tiger Vision News. Here's a look at a few more announcements. Tomorrow is one day further into our second six weeks of school. Check with your teachers to make sure all of your assignments are turned in. You want to make sure you're passing the six weeks. Members of the band perform their fall concert this week. It's Thursday at 7 p.m. Come watch what will be a really great show. The UIL competition is coming up soon. Everyone is looking really forward to showing off their skills. We will have more on the story soon. And don't forget to buy the yearbook. They're 50 bucks and chock full of memories that will last a lifetime. Go see Mrs. Allison or visit www.yearbookforever.com to order. You're not going to want to miss out. Now let's find out what's going on in weather. Hi, I'm Nolly here with your weather today. Current conditions partly cloudy, 72 degrees, wind south, 12 miles per hour. Our chance of rain, also known as precipitation, is 30%. Today's national forecast, it's finally cooling down and we're getting rain. Our grass has been dry recently, so five day forecast for the rest of the week. Cool temperatures the next five days with a chance of rain in our forecast. That's our weather for today, folks. Thank you for watching. Bye, back to you. Now let's see what's going on in sports. Hello FMS sports fans, I'm back again and I'm here with Anolio today. The 8th grade guys play football tonight. It's their last regular season game of the year and they can't wait to hit the field and play one more game before the season is over. Here's more on the story. Hi, I'm Weston, I'm here with... Jaren. Kasson. Kaden. Noah. Neil. What football team are you on? A. Uh, A team. A. Hey. Hey. What are you looking forward to about the McKenzie game this week? Uh, playing defense. Um, I mean, I don't even know. Win. To win the game. Being a bench warmer. Thank you, guys. Good luck tonight, guys. Members of the cross-country team have their championship meet tomorrow. Hi, I'm Jaden. I'm here with... Addison. When's your cross-country meet? Wednesday, October 25th. What times? Uh, girls is at 5, boys is at 5.30. How do you think you're going to do? I think I'll do decent. How many miles? Two. Thank you. It's out at Mason Men's Park at, and starts at 5. We know they'll do a good job. That's it for sports today, guys. Back to, Back to you. you. Well, that's all we have for Tiger Vision today. Everyone have a great afternoon. We'll see you later. Until then, Tigers. Bye. Bye.